The dry season has begun, uh, the seas are back to normal, but also we're getting that chill in those valleys. All courtesy of the clear skies at night, obviously allows the day's heat to quickly escape into space, and also the cool air tends to drift to the lowest part of the valley. So obviously you know where you live, and if you do live in those uh, sheltered valleys, it will feel particularly cool. You can just see here, not much in terms of cloudiness, uh, at least uh, this evening and overnight, all of the rain showers have drifted towards the south into Venezuela. So we should be seeing improving skies as we go through Saturday and the Sunday. All the while, up towards the north, we do have that area of low pressure. But as you can see, the little pockets of cloud that will slip through, those are little pockets will likely bring a few brief showers, but mostly towards uh, the uh, lesser Antilles by the time we get to Monday. So clear skies are for most of you in Tobago through Roxborough and Plymouth. You'll be joined by a lot of sunshine through Saturday morning into the afternoon as well. Fine skies for most of you as you go through your day. Into Trinidad, also clear, cool conditions are expected. Maybe just that brief shower coming across the hillsides through Saturday morning. Also pretty much fair weather. The occasional light shower is possible for Rima, Valencia, into Diego Martin and Pitti Valley. And throughout the day, you may see the sprinkles coming through from time to time. But overall, the sunshine should prevail. So down towards Point Fortin and Pinal, sunny spells for you in the morning as well as into the afternoon. A couple of showers though for Rio Claro, maybe up towards San Fernando as you go through your day. Temperature-wise, looking at lows of 22 degrees Celsius in Trinidad, 24 in Tobago. No higher than 31 by day for both Trinidad and Tobago as you go through the next few days. And then watching for Monday to see a bit more cloudiness here. A few more showers expected, especially for Trinidad into early next week. And for those heading offshore, well, there are no rough seas to speak of. Normal seas have returned two meters in the Atlantic, one to one and a half meters to the Caribbean and northeasterly to northerly swells of 11 seconds for those of you boating. And uh, they're basically looking for those of you looking further afield through the Caribbean. Not much is set to happen here. Fair skies for the most part. A few brief showers for the Eastern Caribbean. Castri is seeing fair skies at 29 degrees Celsius. And also Georgetown is seeing occasional cloudiness as well. But the showers there will be few and far between, despite the clouds. So that's your weather, and that's it from me.